continue to live or by being chosen by me? Hmm. Make a decision there. <laughs> if you choose a lot, you continue to live. It's like, all right, great, game over. You're done. <laughs> One thing that strikes me as odd. I never believed if you ran away, but could a human have really defeated a ghoul? I can't imagine. That's him! That's the man who betrayed me! Uh, so it's not like she really super likes him. I mean, I <laughs> what? what? I like the question mark showed up. Ah, uh, now I understand. We have a little conspiracy here, don't we? <laughs> ah, you're you're an expert on that subject. I I just messed up. <laughs> Defiler of souls, your sins lay heavy upon you. Dude. Awesome. Oh wow, he's a lot more badass in his sprite. Like he suddenly has a cool hat and a crazy beard. Those weren't there before. Can I just point that out? I guess he just sprouted a beard when he... yeah. Boom. Oh no, Arngrim. <laughs> I like that he just uses that giant sword as a club, basically. Right? Like, he's not really swinging it like a sword. He just kind of smashes them with it because it's so big. <laughs> Prepare yourself, rebel scum! Nope. These slipshot s soldiers think they can call me rebel scum. <laughs> Look, friend, don't expect me to do you any favors. I'm not gonna die. I guess they don't have much use for heroes with true strength of an Asgard, huh? <laughs> Vainglorious human, strength is not everything. Huh. You wanna talk, death goddess? <laughs> Impudent fool, Valkyrie is not a goddess of the dark. Such words will result in your certain death. Uh, what the fuck? You knew? But I had glasses on and everything! I'm on it! <laughs> so you're safe, little one. <laughs> <laughs> Bloop! That was very well done. <laughs> ah, get the fuck out, I'm having a conversation here. Aren't you just a death goddess? A god of death is merely responsible for the snuffing out of lives. I, however, can show you the path. Yes. However, you must walk it on your own. Stop this pointless slaughter! Old man. Arngrim. Is that his dad? No, I don't think so. Will you truly raise arms against me? I like how he's got this big old fucking grin on his face. Like he had this smirk. Whoa! Got him! Holy fuck! That was awesome! I was not expecting that! Yeah, me neither. Especially Why after talking about... Save me. I'm not gonna die. Why'd you save me? Consider it a gift. It seems we'll be spending quite a bit of time together. Oh no. That it does, little one. Quite a bit indeed. That was a pretty fucking cool intro. Fate can indeed be a cruel mistress. What is it? Nothing. Let us take leave of here. No, no, literally nothing happened. I like that as she's yes. floating, she has boob jiggle. Only ever so slightly. Like, that. to put that on a sprite takes a lot of work. Um. Mm. And, not, and not have it look completely shit. Feel the presence of the undead as well. Okay, so now we take the souls we've collected off to level up.
that's pretty cool. So maybe is, is that, I mean, I guess I'm going to guess that's the cycle of the game, is we're going to like collect guys and then we're going to level them up and bring them to Asgard once they're strong enough, I guess. Yes, I feel them. They are nearby. Oh wow, fucking awesome! How do I fly? Oh, whoa! This is cool as shit! It's pretty! Doorway to heaven? Oh, okay. It's a good track. Okay, so we're gonna fight some undead down here. And we lose the tutorial badass at the end of the dungeon. Okay, that's fair though. What is that? This is the memory camp. Okay, it's a save point. Having mercy on the undead yeah! is a waste. Okay. I guess data. Yeah, data, save. There we go. Um. People can do. She knows first aid and has a bunch of traits. What? What the fuck is all this? What the fuck? So, so she's got like a bunch of traits, and I guess I get points that I can spend to reduce them. And she has a, oh, okay, I get it. <laughs> Gods do not have human traits. Okay, so this makes sense. That basically, I guess you level these traits up, okay. And then their value is a sum. Wow, his value is really like way lower than than Jolanda's. That's pretty weird. Uh, so let's. Oh, okay, that's a passive skill. So everybody has first aid. Nobody else says anything. All right. First aid's important. Guess so. Divine item. The fuck. What is this stuff? Can I just summon items? Did you get a random item? No, it looks like I can just conjure items. Ah, oh, nibble on the lusty. That sounds cool already. Huh, interesting. You make items with materialized points. Okay, so I guess that's instead of money, I, I have materialized points. That's kind of cool. That's kind of a cool gimmick. Brandish sword. sword. X button. Okay, so if I hit them first, I can get like a first swing, I guess. Yeah, I can see now why people are saying Indivisible is extremely inspired by this game. The iron bars are shut tightly. Okay. Well, let's go back over this way. Find ourselves a, a monster to fight. Yeah. yeah! I brandished a sword, guys. Ah, it's a Zimbab. Oh, wow. I don't know what I was supposed to do. To be Divine assault. Oh man, the smoothness of the sprite animation in this game is very good. Fighting the shadowy gods is the name of this song. Whoa, that did a lot of damage. Such so, filthy creatures. 
I'm pretty sure what happened there is I filled that hit meter up, and then I got a special move. Have been released. We have result. no reason to remain here. It's pretty sweet. Boom, 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 boom. Have fun, find yarn and stuff. I see. Will you get milk and whatnot while you're out? Cool. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you just get grocery things. Grocery things. Yeah. Uh, Greatest sword. I'm gonna turn this up a little bit. You guys tell me if I get any kind of echo or whatever. Because I want to actually hear the music. Cool. It shall be engraved upon your soul. Oh yeah! Now I'm not sure if I messed this up. Or if it would have been possible for me to do that on the other enemy instead. You have no hope of survival. Or if that's just not a thing. That's fucking good. Yeah. I'm Bogard. How do I get past that? Dodge. Cool. Alright. As expected, we are the victors. This is fucking cool. I'm really digging this. Backline caster's get an ability called familiar or something to punch through. Okay, so I just beat him up. Got it. Found an eye of heaven. Okay, it seems like a really weird thing to just randomly find. Do you just want my card? No, no. That's that's important. Cool. To my side, my noble Einherjar. Ah, uh, no mercy. Awesome. Okay. So they have like a vertical hitbox thing that I have to make sure I account for. Makes sense. Nice. This isn't too hard so far, but I guess we're still technically in the tutorial. That was too easy. What's next? Oh man, the music and everything in this game is just fucking fantastic. The iron barred key. Okay, so I can go back to the iron bars for which the key seems to be named. <laughs> and we can go through there. That's pretty cool. I really like the movement speed. Because it makes backtracking and whatnot not feel like such a fucking grind. I think you can use that key there. Yeah, okay. Listen, bro. I get into the tutorial, but come on now. Oh, it's a little FMV over one part of the screen. Interesting how they did that. Cunning, actually. They managed to make it pretty much perfectly in there. Okay, what is it now, Freya? You climb down and leap down. Leaping is a handy way to open real quickly. Oops. Alright, so is it possible for me to switch target during an action is kind of my question here? Doesn't look like it. Now, I'm gonna not attack with Jolanda, because I think that means I can keep her available for the next attack, right? Okay, that makes sense. So if I don't attack with everyone on one guy, then the ones who didn't attack can attack the other guy. Makes sense. I'm digging this so far. Like, I'm really enjoying it. 